uh, Fort Sask, the Henry House, um, Rose. <laughs> uh, you know, again, it was one of these moments where we had the this this sort of matriarch come forward, and, and we connected with her. There was sort of this very stern, maybe kind of protective element um, of this lady who wanted to keep her house the way that that she wanted and, and certainly we had to be very respectful and very sort of diligent as far as the way we conducted ourselves in that space uh, but it was an, another one of these locations that is forever etched in my mind because we got some very strong communication and another example of these matriarchs these strong women coming through we had the opportunity to once again come back to Fort Saskatchewan and I mean this area is just a wealth of uh, spiritual activity. Now we were at the Henry House. Uh, Dr. Henry who had lived there and worked for the community uh, over a number of years and so um, the house uh, it actually the where it's sitting now is not where it was sitting originally um, but we had the opportunity to speak with his wife. We all got the sense of like a beautiful energy right from the get-go when we arrived and looking at photos and then interacting with her we really got that sense once again. Uh, I think there were some unanswered questions near the end of our investigation uh, where we were wondering about, she said she was seeing Indian men. Uh, so, you know, there, there always is unanswered questions. There's always more to learn about the stories, the spirits that are there. And I, I still think there's more of a story to be told in that area that isn't just um, around the settler era when settlers came, but there's so much deeper history there spiritually with uh, the indigenous nations that resided there. Fort Saskatchewan was really, yeah, there was the, I believe her name was Rose. Um, but it was about the men that were outside. All of the season, we're getting back to touching the roots of who we are. Myself, um, Aaron, our, our ancestors have been here all along. They're saying, we're watching, we're, we got your back. You know, and, and to, feed, to feed them as well with the pemmican that we did. And also to feed Rose. You know, I think Rose is going to stay there for a while because that's her house. You know, and to short, not to be afraid of those of those warriors that are sitting out there.